Hey guys, I'm David and welcome to the channel and today I have another band press the figure to review for you guys and this time it's of course from one of my favorite animes of all time Kimetsu no Yaiba and we have another addition to our Hashira collection so I have here the DXF figure of Mushira Tokido we haven't seen a lot of Tokido yet from the anime but I assure you that he is one of the most interesting characters from the anime so before we start I actually opened the figure already because we had a live unboxing during one of Mainstream Manila's Mainstream TV podcast last week and uh, it's a band press to one-on-one -on -one episode and I opened this one live so anyway I'll probably be skipping the unboxing part of this figure but we will be taking a closer look at the figure and see how awesome Tokito is so come and join me and let's take a closer look at the Tokito figure. Let's take a look at the box first before we take a closer look at the figure. Uh, we have of course the Bandai, Band Presto, and the Maslayer logo here. And of course a photo of Tokito and he looks really cool. And this is the side. This is the other side. And of course this figure comes with the Tengen Sepia version which I haven't gotten yet. So I'll probably be getting that because I really want to complete the Sepia version of these figures. Anyway, this is the top, it says B, and this is the bottom. So like I said, I've already opened this box. So this is what the figure looks like and it looks very nice. So let's take a closer look at the figure. Okay, so before we take a closer look at the figure, let's measure him first. He stands at around 16 centimeters or 6.5 inches from the base to the head. And uh, let's take a closer look at the figure. Let's look at the head first. And I really like this color scheme. So we have here a minty green color scheme. And look at those nice eyes there. There we go. They painted it very well. And uh, I really like the way that they painted his hair. So as you can see there, it resembles how they painted or the artwork of Nezuko's hair so anyway it's good so you can also see on his sword there the same color pattern same color scheme here you can see there the gold paint and of course the belt and it's actually wearing a different kind of demon core uniform but you can still see underneath uh, the sign of the demon core there I don't know if you can see it anyway there you go uh he's of course wearing his slippers or sandals there with uh socks <laughs> and yeah it's a very simple figure but and I really like how they designed him so as a quick comparison I'll be bringing out of course two Hashira so we have here Rengoku and Mine's a bit dirty on the nose. But anyway, we have Rengoku and Giyu. And man, they look fantastic together. Look at that. Of course, it's a bit small because he is the youngest among the Hashiras. And yes, they look fantastic together when you put them side by side. Unfortunately, the base is a bit big, so I can't really put them side by side. But I think, okay, there you go. I know Rengoku has some. Uh, you can remove Rengoku's legs here so there we go that's how tall he is compared to them and of course they scale very well and that's to be expected from the DXF line so overall this is a great figure it's a simple figure but they captured the image of Tolkito very well I like the color scheme and I really like the details of his face it looks very nice of course the value for money on this one is spot on and he looks fantastic together with the other Hashiras. And yeah, I can't wait to complete all of the Hashiras from the Demon Slayer anime. So if you're a fan of Kimetsu no Yaiba, and of course, if you want to complete all of the Hashiras from the Demon Slayer anime, of course, you have to get him. I want to thank Mainstream Manila for this figure. I got this from them. Thank you very much, Mainstream Manila. I'll put the link down in the description box on how you can get this awesome figure. Oh, by the way, guys, if you're living in the Philippines and you want to win one of these awesome figures, 
we are currently having a giveaway on our Facebook page together with Mystery Manila. So thank you very much, Mystery Manila and Van Presto for this figure. So I'll put the link down in the description box on how you can join that contest. So yeah, good luck everyone. That's it for this video. Thank you very much for watching. I'm David once again, and always remember to unbox your toys.